Hello, everyone. Good evening and welcome to the class. Good evening, Miss. Good evening. How? Good evening, Miss. Hi, good evening, Miss. How are you? I'm doing good. What about you? So far, so good. So far, so good. Perfect. That's good. Excellent. So welcome to the class. Thank you for being here. I know you're happy. I hope you're happy because I'm happy. I'm happy because today it's Friday. Finally Friday. So tomorrow is Saturday and then we have the Sunday, right? And we are free. Do you work on Saturdays? Of course. You work on Saturdays? Okay. Yes. Okay. I used to work on Saturdays. Now I don't work on Saturdays anymore, which is good. I like it. Okay. We're gonna to continue today with a topic that we should have started yesterday. That was the couldn't might. So we're gonna have that topic today and we're gonna to start that now. Wait a moment. But before we start with that, I would like to start with the attendance because you know that's the most important thing we need, we gotta do. Okay, Ana Veronica Hernandez Rodriguez. Present. Blanca Isabel Tunaca de Rodriguez. Present, Miss. Excellent. Carlos Alberto Meléndez Rosales. Present. Clelia Estela Flores Hernandez. Present. Eric Enrique Reyes Martinez. Present. Okay. Eric Giovanni Jimenez Canizales. Eric Josué Reyes Molina. Henry Adonai Torres Gómez. Acabo de Jesús Gómez Gómez. Jenny's Carolina Vázquez de Medrano. Jenny's Carolina. Present, Miss. Yes. Johnny Alexander Escobar Calderón. Present, Miss. Jonathan José Oliva Enríquez. José Alfredo Hueso López. Jocelyn Angelina Ramírez Melgar. Jocelyn Angelina Ra Ramírez Melgar. ¿Está oyendo? Eh, ahí, ajá, ya acabo de mandar un mensaje. Yo. Ok, al chat de WhatsApp. Eh, sí, al WhatsApp. Ok, ya voy a ver. Julio César Aguillón Arevalo. Present. María Julia Ramos Olívar. Present, Miss. Mayra Patricia Artiga Vázquez. Oscar René Molina Calidonio. Present, Miss. Oseas Figueroa Cisneros. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Hernández Castillo. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Ramiro Rafael Aguilar Díaz. Present, Miss. Sandra Yanira Gómez Romero. Present, Miss. Silvia Patricia Aceituno Méndez. Present, Miss. Verónica Elizabeth Burgos Rivas. Present, Miss. Miss, I will say listening of the first hour, please, okay? Okay. Amado Javier Rutia Rivera. Está. Jacqueline Lisette García Miranda. No? Okay. Perfect. So, as I was saying before, thank you very much for um, being here. Thank you very much for your puntuality. I know that's something very important to us. Puntuality is very important in these classes because, as you know, we have um, the attendance 
based on the minutes you are connected to the class. So every single minute co counts, okay? So you need to be here on time to have your all your minutes, like 120 minutes. Let me check the WhatsApp because I have many messages. Mm -hmm. I have many oyentes today. Okay, I have it's Jonathan. Right, it's right and miss. It's the have body, you know. The body. Body. Now it. Okay, um, oh. Jonathan, I think this is luminous. I think that is a cobo. And Jocelyn and Veronica and Maria Julia. Let me write that down. Jocelyn, Veronica, Jonathan, and Maria Julia. A cobo no creo que se conecte. I don't think he's carrying on the class. Okay, anyway, so we're gonna continue and we're gonna start with a question right now. Let me share my screen with you and you can see the question that we're gonna be discussing today. So this is the question. The first question is, what is a promotional activity? Okay, what is a promotional activity? Next question is, how do you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products. So once again, what is a promotional activity? I want you to discuss with your group, what do you consider to be a promotional activity? The next question, how do you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products? If you were the manager of a restaurant, how will you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products? So I will like you to answer these questions, okay? And I would like you to give me examples, at least two or three examples uh, about promotional activities for your restaurant products, okay? Do you understand the activity we're gonna do? Yes, yeah, miss. Okay. Yes, miss. Excellent. Okay, so if you take a screenshot and send it to the WhatsApp group, that will be really good. Okay. I appreciate it. Okay. Let me create these rooms. Wisefully. Thank you. Okay, there we go. Hello, hello. 
Ahí tienen las invitaciones para que se puedan unir. You have the invite so you can join the break rooms. Esto es el ejemplo de... Rafael, welcome to the class. 
Hi, Miss. Sorry, I have a problem with the with the internet. Okay, but you are here now. Okay, so your classmates are doing an activity, and maybe they are going to come back like in a minute or two. So I'm gonna send you used to a room. Okay. Okay. Ana, welcome to the class. Sí, mis, lo que pasa es que nunca se terminó de asignar a mi grupo, que era el uno. Entonces volví a ingresar. Mm, no lo dejó el internet. No. Mm -hmm. Ok. Bueno, ya vienen sus classmates, ok. Así que esperamos. Ah, ok, aquí. de acuerdo. Bueno. Okay, let's answer the question. The question was, what is a promotional activity? So a promotional activity, who wants to answer this question? I'm gonna say it voluntarily today. Let's see if you want to participate. Excellent, Ramiro, thank you. The promotional activity is when uh, uh... The a restaurant uh, uh, free uh, or give a uh, gift for uh, uh, any person interested in um, the the purchase. 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 Okay. Okay. So when a, a restaurant does an activity for free, so for free, are interested in to purchase, right? Yes. Excellent. Thank you, Ramiro. Good answer. Someone else wants to participate voluntarily. Carlos. In uh, uh, give a piece of chicken for for complete the uh, online survey. Oh yeah, give a piece of chicken when you complete uh, an online survey. The survey online. Yes, survey online. Okay. Okay. Okay, good example, Carlos. Thank you very much. Oscar René, tell me, then Johnny. Oscar, your microphone. Sorry, cuando tiene que estar encendido, no. <laughs> At least, least once a week, put to four and one ditches. One week. Once a week. Algo así es. Okay, at least once a week. At least once a week. One put dish. To four one dishes. Four to four one dishes. Yes. I don't understand. No. Like at least once a week, repeat the other part. 
put. No sé por qué puso put. Put. Two. Two. Four. One. Dishes. Put two for one dishes. Yeah. Pon para Can you say it in Spanish? Eh, por lo menos una vez a la semana poner platos al dos por uno. Oh, got it. Okay, okay, okay. Give like um for the price of one get two. Yep. For the price of one get two. Okay, yes, that's good. Oscar, thank you very much. Thank you for your sí, anote la señorita del pericón, dice. <laughs> Yeah, she's she's taking notes. Johnny, go ahead. The advertising, no sé cómo se pronuncia. Advertising, advertising campaign for the launch of the new products. Okay, advertising is good as well. Yeah, that's true. Okay. Okay, thank you, Johnny. So okay, so, so you're asking how do you create successful promotional activities for your restaurant products? Okay, so give me more examples. Nobody else? You don't have more examples? Nope. Let me ask you something. If you had a restaurant, and this is a question about the nowadays marketing, right? Nowadays is like hoy en día, right? Nowadays. Nowadays, we are living in a different world. Nowadays, yeah, you can do the same things you told me. That is totally fine, and I and I agree. But how do you reach more people? How do you get more people interested in your restaurant? Let's think about the things that are popular right now. So what do you think we can do? Eric? Um, using social media. Social media. Excellent, Eric. So depending on the kind of people or the audience you want to get is the social media you're going to use, right? Because not all the social medias are for all the ages, right? We have some people on Facebook, and I will say on Facebook, we have people from 25 years old and on, because the younger ones, they don't like Facebook, right? Then we have some people on what other social media would you say? Um, on Instagram. On Instagram, yes, we have people on Instagram. What else? Because only watch uh, picture. Pictures, yes. Only watching pictures. Yes, that's true. What else? There is one. We can you use Facebook uh, and, and add in YouTube. Okay. And add in YouTube and just Facebook. Okay. So I think uh, nowadays very popular the delivery. Because all of us uh, don't want to to go to the to the point of selling, mm -hmm. uh, all of us want to receive the all the things in in our house. Okay. So I think delivery is very important for all companies. Okay, to offer delivery, yes. Yes. True. That's true. And do you think it will be a good way to get um, customers if you offer a promotional, like a promotion in delivery? Like you don't pay delivery this this day. You free. Yeah. Yeah. Free. You free delivery yeah. for a day or a discount in delivery. Something yeah. like that. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Now tell me, think about it. What is the most popular social network right now? Instagram. It's TikTok. TikTok. It's TikTok. Yeah. That's the most popular yeah. social network that there is. But, 
but but promotional uh, uh, in product uh, offered and TikTok is a is a in person. Oh. So you don't think you don't think uh the promotional offers on TikTok are good, or you you don't think people watch that on TikTok? Um, no, I think no. yes. Okay, let I'm me give you product. Yeah, but let me tell you something. Do you know about your Frank? Oh yeah, eh, es in, eh, ¿cómo le llaman? Eh, que, que tiene muchos seguidores. ¿cómo se llama? Influencer. Yes. Okay. Yes, that is true. So, using TikTok is important, but getting an influencer, do you think that is important as well? Yes. Okay. Yes, it's a more, it's a much uh, follower. Yeah, they have more followers. Correct. So there was one time I, I think I told you like a couple, I don't know, weeks ago or modules ago. Theo Frank had a, uh, well, he made a video about a pupuseria in La Escalón, right? It was La Papusa, something like that. It was called. And the thing different about this pupuseria was that they put letters on the pupusas and they can write your name on the, or they can write the like Q and R and the F and Q, frijoles con queso, right? Like you, like the distinguished things, you know. So they put the letters on that. And the restaurant seemed really nice. The pupusa seemed big and it was good. So, but I realized because I saw it on the Instagram uh, page that they made the video with Theo Frank, but they were not ready. They were not prepared for all the people that went to that restaurant that weekend. Because many people watched the TikTok and they went to the restaurant. What happened? It was full. They couldn't cover the people. People were angry because they get it. They didn't get what they they asked for. Lines were long lines. Many people were trying to get in. They couldn't. So then, people didn't go to the restaurant. What do you think was the mistake in that case? Not prepare enough materials. Okay. Not preparing enough materials and people as yeah. well. And personal. Yeah. Yeah. And personal. Yeah. Like, do you know these um, companies, for example, they sell clothes, like they sell clothes or they sell, I don't know, things for the house, refrigerators, appliances, and all the stuff. When it's December, they hire season employees, right? Empleados de temporada. Because they know they are going to get more people, right? So here is the thing. Getting an influencer to promote, like to do a promotional video about your place is going to get a lot of people interested in the same time, like at the same time. And what you have to do is to give a good impression that one time, because if you don't, then people won't come back anymore, right? Because then they will say, no, I don't like it because and this and this and this and this. So you need to get and take advantage of that one time and then like try to, I don't know, try to talk about reservations, right? This place works with reservations. So many people will go, right, to the reservation website, whatever, and they will have the tables and when it's full, it will say to to get another day, like in a hotel, right? In a hotel, you do a reservation. If there is no chance to go that day, maybe another day, right? Wait a second. Mm, but I think it's different. Uh huh. Because the the hotel is to be stayed there, and the restaurant is so. I need to propose something. Yeah. Think... Uh, yeah. 
Continue, continue, Julio. So, eh, the week, weekend is more casual to eat pupus. Yeah. Is that the informal activity? Yes. Okay. Yeah, that's true. So, to get ready, to get as many people to work for you. But yeah, that's a good activity. The, like to get a promotional video from a TikToker or influencer, that works a lot, a lot, let me tell you. So that's one um, marketing strategy of nowadays marketing, right? Like that's what is working these days. Okay, let's go to- Your friend, Uncle Frank, is the, in, of this video says, uh, I will visit the place. And finish it in video. No. Would you visit this place? Would you visit? Like, it's a question, right? Yes. Is Would you visit this place? Yeah, correct. Uh -huh. Would you visit this place? Yes, correct. Yeah, but many people, when they watch the video, they watch it on the same day, probably. So you see, like, on TikTok, what is the average likes you have on TikTok? You know what is probably. average? Do you know the average? Do you know what is the meaning of the word average? Promedio? Yeah, correct. So let's see what is the average they watch videos, Theo Frank's videos. Let me check. It says, okay, look at this. Five, <laughs> I mean, 500, 41,000, So are you ready to get all that people? Yeah, that's the people that watch it, only watch it, they didn't like it. The people who liked the video, 25,200. 25,200. So are you ready to get that much people? Like, yeah, it is It is a lot of people. And I don't think business are ready to get that. For example, there is like a cowboy, cowboy restaurant that is getting popular nowadays. Like, yeah. like that one, they have the, the food like that, right? Yeah. Thanks. So he has 55,000 likes on that video, 55,000. So 55,000 people will like to go to that place. So then he has 7,000, no, seven, 765 comments. So that's a lot of people, right? And they pay the video. Do you know how they pay a video on TikTok? Do you know how you get paid for a video on TikTok? No, it's free. Yeah, but the influencers, they get paid for it, right? They get Acora, paid for the video. Acora? <laughs> no, they get paid for the video, but they don't get paid like, okay, let's make this video, and for the video, I'm going to give you $100. That's not how it works. Do you know how it works? Depending on how many people watch like and comment the video that's how they get paid okay they get paid like a hundred dollars maybe to make the video but every time a person interacts with the video they get paid more because that's more people that's why they ask you would you go to this place so you answer yes i would no i wouldn't that comment is money for them. Yes? Got it? So depending the interaction. For example, in YouTube, you can see that on YouTube. On YouTube, they say subscribe, like, and comment because that reaches more people. And then YouTube is going to pay you based on what people are doing with your video. Yes? So that's why they do it like that. It may, being an influencer is money. Yes. In YouTube, is is more easy. Easier? Use the platform. More easy, Carlos, or easier? More, more, more easier. No, 
Only easy. No, no, no. only per surface. Okay. Is, is easier? Easier. Uh, use the platform. Uh, uh, in in this uh, platform, you can see uh, uh, the person for countries. Mm -hmm. And in a study, in a study for concern, uh, you know uh, what, uh, what, what the person is. How many people? How many people see Salvador, Mala, oh. Honduras? Based on the countries? Yes. Do you have a YouTube channel, Carlos? Uh, I start. <laughs> You're starting a YouTube channel? Like yes, playing? Yes. You, what, what kind of games do you play? Yes, yes, yes. yes. A perfect and, and Facebook, uh, I have uh, one, there are 120 uh, photos and, and YouTube. One thousand four hundred five person C are not follow. Oh, no followers, <laughs> but they watch your videos, but they don't yes. follow you. Yes. Oh, okay. And do you have a Twitch account, right? Yes. Okay, that is another social network that maybe because we are all we don't know a lot about it, but Twitch is getting very popular between the kids. Kids and teenagers. Do you know what is Twitch? Hey, miss. It's Rafael? like a Twitter. It's and like you, a Twitter. Mm, no, it's not like a Twitter. And you, and you profile or, 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 or channel in TikTok? The class in the English or kids in English? No, I yeah. don't do it. I don't do it. I, I don't like it. I don't, I don't like to be popular. Okay. I, I don't I don't like I don't like to be there expose myself but that's that's you you might see that I'm extrovert and I speak and I do the stuff because this is my job but really and I am introvert only yeah, only so 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 see solo speaker and just charting in, in Twitch or kick without uh -huh. my face uh -huh. yeah yeah maybe no but I haven't thought about it <laughs> <laughs> yeah i haven't thought about it okay well anyways let's continue because i see some classmates are sleeping other ones are playing on the phone and other ones are doing other stuff and they are not involved in the class right remember when you have your cameras off let me know why okay we're gonna jump right in with this conversation luigi oh if you have questions you can ask me at the end Luigi. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of spicy pizza to the menu. We worked in an action plan, but we need to save costs and get customers to try the new product. How about promotional activities at the restaurant? You know, you could discount the green pepper sticks that never sell. Then customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sounds like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving free samples, but he isn't telling people the pizza is super spicy. <laughs> okay, do you need me to repeat a pronunciation or tell you about a meaning of a word? Counting up. Who counting? Handing up. out. No, you hung them up. Hook them up. The this man. one. This one. Yes. You hook them up. Hook them up is like um. You get people interested in that. 
Okay. Yeah, that's a synonym name for it. You get people interested on that. So hook you up is like when you get interested on something. What else? Nope. Everything good? They need how traditional traduction uh, you hold them up. You hook them up. Yeah. Like you get people interested on something. You want me to tell you in Spanish? Enganchar, miss. Yeah, correct. Enganchar. What? Johnny, can you repeat that? Please. Enganchar. Ah, okay. Hook them up. Hook them up, like, yeah, like what Johnny said. So it means, again, that you get people interested on something. Okay, what else? Nothing? This is, is, uh, is a joker, no. Is a what? Es como una broma. Hook them up? No, this is not a joke. This is like, uh, you hook them up with the spicy pizza, like los enganchan, los, uh, how can I say this? Los interesan. They, they like enganchar, like enganchar, eh, yeah. enganché con esto, like. Capturar. Yeah, capture tu atención with the spicy pizza. Yeah, okay, okay, yeah. Okay. Ah, okay, Thank you. Up. Yep. Okay, let me send he said, you. She said another enganchar. Sí. Like, yeah, like when you get <laughs> a, a prank, like, like with a like, prank. Like bajar. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. It's not what it means. <laughs> okay. It's a okay. I'm going to send you an audio. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of spicy pizza to the menu. We worked in an action plan, but we need to save cost and get customers to try the new product. How about promotional activities at the restaurant? You know, you could discount the green pepper sticks that never sell. Then customers will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sounds like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a baseball game. You could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving free samples, but he isn't telling people that the pizza is super spicy. So Luigi is giving samples outside of the pizza, the pizzeria, right? But he's not telling the people that the that the, the pizza is spicy. And that's a problem because some people don't like spicy things, right? Yeah? Yeah. Muy picante. Yeah, it's very, very spicy. Mucho picante. Sometimes I, don't, I, I, I think that somos Oscar, Johnny, Jose Alfredo, Oseas, Ramiro, and Carlos, y yo contra el mundo. Eso es lo que me estaba acompañando con la cámara encendida. Ya. Yeah. Oh my God. What is it? Uh, bueno, Rafael y yeah. Ramiro, they are talking. My, my, my camera doesn't work. No, apaguémoslas todas No, don't do that. Sí, don't do apaguémoslas, that. apaguémoslas. No. En huelga, en huelga, porque no las ponen de más. Así que, no, adiós. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Oh, no, my God, no, come no, on. No, no, you see, no, now we have Jenny's. No. Yeah, we have Jenny's now. Excellent. Good. Sometimes sí. I feel alone. You have to ask, ask them. Mayra, <laughs> excellent. Good. Eric, Jose, oh, my goodness. Now I feel like there's more people here. Ya ves que funciona la huelga, así que vamos todos, apaguemos. <laughs> You're right, José Alfredo. <laughs> there we have Lisette, good, good. Apago, Blanca, there we go with Blanca. <laughs> José, turn on your camera. 
Va, ya ve, ya ve, ya ve. ¿Cuántas más se abrieron? It's working, it's working, it's working. Lisa, turn off the camera again. It's time, it's solo que me da pena. Why are you shy? Ay, ¿por qué? Si todos look, estamos despeinados, ¿ves? Look at me. Estamos oh, despeinados, cabrón. I'm not an extrovert. I'm not, I'm really? not, I'm not uh, despeinado. Miss, in my case, is uh, working also. You're working right now? Yes, prepare the indicators for the turnover, absentees, uh, headcount, HR department, working and listen to you. Uh, okay, so you're doing two activities at the same time? Yes, yes, and, yes. And are you getting the class? Yes, also, I okay. can. Okay, okay, I like that. Excellent, Mayra, thank you very much. Okay, okay, okay. but I hope that everyone, that, that, that all the people that have the cameras off, okay, at least they are listening to me, because if you're listening to me, I'm good with that. But if you're not listening to me, I feel, <laughs> I don't know, it feels, it feels, I don't know, it feels weird, right? Okay, so let's go here. Can you... Take a screenshot of this and send it to the WhatsApp group, please, because I sent you the um the audio already. If you can send a picture, I will appreciate that. Um, one? No? I'm gonna stop sharing. Okay, so now we're gonna go to the breaker rooms and practice, excellent, good. And practice this conversation really quick, okay? Let me see if I like the breaker rooms. Teacher, yo tengo una pregunta. Fíjese que no he podido entrar al portal, no a la... Platform. Yes, yes. Eh, porque ninguno de los dos me, me agarra, pero ayer usted hizo como una anotación de otro compañero y yo. Uh -huh. Sé que, que, que tendríamos que hacer en este caso. Yo le escribí a la chica que, que está encargada del grupo, pero no me contestó. Ok, I texted them yesterday, but they didn't give me an answer. And I sent a message again today in the afternoon. And they say they will, they will look up into it. So... Maybe let's wait for the weekend and let's, I don't know. I hope I have an answer for you on Monday. Okay. Maybe I will, maybe I will have an answer for you on Monday. Okay, Lisette? Okay, perfect. And um, the activity uh, you are, you will going to um, in the, in the plat platform. Yeah, in the platform, you have to answer the activities. But in the case of you and I think it's Javier Rutia, we can understand that this week you are not doing the activities because you don't have access to the platform. But if you have access next week, you will have to complete section one and section two, okay? Okay, miss. Okay. I will be wait. Okay, excellent. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Okay, let's go there.
Anyone else in practice? José Alfredo. Start again. You can hear me? Yes, 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 yes. José Figueroa with José Alfredo. Yes, okay. I start. Please. Okay. Go ahead. To try the All about promotional activities at the restaurant, you know. You call this column the green papers speaker than never said. The customer will get the green papers speaker and you hook them up with the species pizza. Uh, no. Okay. Go ahead, Carl, uh, Lisa. I will be Carl. Okay. Uh, Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of base pizza to the menu. We were we worked in action plan, but we need to say cause and I and get customers to try the new product. How about promotional activities at the restaurant? You know, you call this coin the green pepper sticks that never sell. Then customer with uh, will get the green pepper sticks and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sound like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or a excuse me baseball game you call offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event oh my i will call you later luigi is outside the restaurant giving free sample, but he isn't telling people
<clears throat> okay, welcome back. Now let's choose some participants to do the conversation here. But before we start with that, I would like to say, to tell you something. Um, remember that I send you an audio with each conversation so you can listen to the audio and then practice the conversation. If you have questions about pronunciation and I'm not in the break room, you can listen to the audio and listen to that pronunciation. Because sometimes when I go to the break rooms, I hear mispronunciations. Mispronunciation means malas pronunciaciones. So I can listen to many mispronunciations, right? And what happens is that you are not listening to the audios, right? You have to listen to the audio, you have to ask me, and also you can look the words, um, you can look for the words in, I don't know, Google, you can look on Google, pronunciation, it will tell you how the pronunciation it is, right? So I'm gonna choose some participants to help me with pronunciation and to help me with the conversation we just practiced, okay? Okay, let me see. Javier Urrutia and Lisette Garcia. Uh, Lisette, you start. Hi. Hi. Yes. Okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new king of spicy pizza to the menu. We worked in the action plane, but we need to say calls and get customers to try the new product. How about promotional activity on the restaurant? You know, you call this town the green pepper sticks that never sell. Then customer will get the green pepper stick and you hook, hook them up with the spice pizza. I didn't think of that. So like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a bit even like a concert or invisible game. You could offer a discount to the people how about a pickup for the event? Oh my, I will call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving, for example, but he isn't telling people the pizza is super spicy. Okay, thank you very much. Let's give them an applause. Good job, thank you. Okay, now let's look for the corrections. Okay. Spicy, spicy, action plan, but could, could, you say, uh, you, don't say you don't say the letter L, the, the letter L, you don't say it, okay? It's just could, could. Cool, cool. Without the L. Without the L, you don't say the letter L, right? Could. 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 Like Q U D. Could. Okay, spicy again. Idea. Might. Have. Event. Trend. Baseball. Baseball. Could. Could. Who. The event. Pizza. Pizza. Okay, let's choose okay. some of the participants. We're going to choose now. Let me see. We're going to choose Mayra and Julio Aguillon. Mayra, you start. Okay. Luigi is going to introduce a new kind of spicy pizza to the menu. We work it in an action plan, but we need to save cost and get customers to try the new product. How about the promotional activities in the restaurant? You know, you could 
discuss the green paper stick that never sell. Then customer will get the green pepper stick and you hook them up with the spicy pizza. I didn't think of that. Sounds like a good idea. You might want to have a promotional activity close to a big event like a concert or or a baseball game. It could offer a discount to the people who bought a ticket for the event. Oh my, I will call you later. Luigi is outside the restaurant giving free samples, but he isn't telling people that pizza is super spicy. Okay, good job, everyone. Thank you very much. Excellent, Mayra and Julio. Just let's go with the corrections. <coughs> pizza worked with a T at the end. Worked, worked at the could discount is a palabra. Let's go. To, like, I, I repeat the mispronunciations. You repeat the mispronunciations. This word is event. Okay. Event and spicy again. Okay. Excellent. Thank you very much. We're going to go here and we're going to see how we use could and might. Okay. Use could and might to make formal suggestions or requests. We use could to make suggestions, okay? When you want to suggest something, you can use could, like a possibility. Someone can do this as a possibility. For example, you could talk to your manager about bundling products for the promotional event. Could talk, right? You could generate businesses business in a community event you could these are like suggestions i'm giving you like an advice a suggestion that you can follow now might is often used with one or like remember we didn't we did an activity in the platform and we used this want or like is often used with might right and it's used to add politeness do you know what is the meaning of politeness Yes. What um, is it? Like uh, educado. Yeah, when you are like an educated person, it's politeness, right? So an example we have here is you might want to have a big promotional event with a celebrity. You might like to schedule a promotional event along a holiday like Black Friday, okay? So might and like and could. Could is to give suggestions, might is to do it with politeness. So here we have some examples, okay? It says, we could drive a car covered in propaganda around the city, right? The boss could might, have, might because we have one. Excellent, Johnny. The boss Thank might you. want to start the event with a speech. Okay, you're gonna do this activity, okay? And when you finish, like filling out with could or might, you're gonna do this activity. This is the vocabulary practice. I know, I think Johnny has it and everyone that did the activities uh, on the platform with me yesterday, you have it. So if you can say public stunts, it's literal A. What is a public stunt? Um, cool. What is a public stunt? A number five. A plan number event number designed four. to attract the public's attention? Yes. Letter A. It's letter A here. So you're going to write letter A here. Okay. So you're going to do two activities right now. This activity and this activity. Is that clear? Yes. Yes, yeah. Miss. Yes, so when you tell, when you finish, you're going to send the screenshot to the WhatsApp group. And you're gonna tell me the breakout room you were in, okay? I get it. Good. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, let's go.
Hello, welcome back. So, I think we got confused, right? Because we thought the um, letter A was the last one. Let's review that. Okay, you say publicity stunts. Two groups said that this is the letter A, a plant event designed to attract public's attention. Let's look at the homework we did yesterday. A public event to attract the public's attention is bundling, right? Bundling. And Publicity Offering stunts several. offering several products for sale as one combined product. Okay. I think that was the main mistake. Yes, in those activities. So we need to check that. But now <clears throat> let's go with the next activity because we need to go right in with the next activity. Okay, because of the time. Okay, let's answer this question. It will be pretty quick no longer than five minutes. And this is, are procedures in a restaurant important? Yes, they are. No, they aren't. Is a customer's experience in a restaurant affected by procedures? Yes, it is. No, it isn't. What do you think? Are procedures important? Are, are procedures in a restaurant important? Yes, it's yes, very, very important. important. Okay, the procedures are very important in a restaurant. And do you think that a customer's experience in a restaurant is affected by procedures? Sometimes. Yes. Yes, it yes. is. Yes, it is. Can you give me an example of it? When the... Uh, um, the like uh the the example for the uh, offering uh, many many service and is uh, is bad experience for the people like the, you say the the Tio Frank mm -hmm. okay is is bad experience in uh, all people talk bad the this restaurant Okay, okay, because they didn't have a good procedure. For, for example, okay, if waiter or waist waitress has to clean the table after a client uh, leaves a table, and waiter or waitress uh, don't do it, that is a problem. Okay, that is a procedure, right? Yeah, they have to clean the table. Good, good, good examples. Anyone else? What is the main procedure they do when you get to a restaurant? What is the first thing they do? Greetings. Greetings, okay, that is part of the procedures. What else? Salutation. What is it, Johnny? Salutation. Can you repeat that? Salutation. Can you say know. it in Spanish? Uh, no sé, el saludo al principio. Oh, greetings. Greetings. greetings, greetings. Okay. Yeah, it's the same. Yeah, good ideas. What else? In, uh, in my last experience, exactly, uh, is the practice seven steps for the customer. First step is the reading. Second is the offered products. Um, and more finally is the collection step. The collection step. The collection step, yes. What is the collection step about? Can you explain that? Uh, would you like the bills, credit oh. card, cash? Okay, okay, okay. That is in Texaco, you say? Yes, yes. Okay, like in the, when you get gas or when you go to the store? In the gas. Okay, so you work with Texaco? Yes, I work it. Oh. 
Okay, okay, excellent. Thank you, Mayra. Good example. Okay, yes, you're procedures, procedures as well. Okay, what else? Do you have more examples? Yes, it's necessary. We are ready uh, before to the uh, open the doors. Open the doors. Yes, they open yeah. the doors and they do the greetings, right? Yes. What else? But what do they do after they greet the person? What do they, they do? Take the order. Offering the, the menu. Ahí les ofrecen el menú donde están parados y les toman la orden. No. Oh, so tal vez, um, and, and the um and serving them. Serving? Okay, but what do they do before that? The okay. Welcome to the restaurant and then locate the client. Locate yeah. the client in a table. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. They sit you in a table and they ask you, like, do you like to sit here? Or would you like to sit there? Or if there is a children's area, would you like to sit in the children's area, right? Or what happens if the restaurant is full? You have to wait. Mm -hmm. for what do they do? They offer wait. something to wait. Yeah, but what do they do when you have to wait? Uh, take the yeah. name or last name. They ask for a last name and how many people, right? So yeah. this procedure, do you think that this procedure is important, writing the last names and the number of people? Yes. Why? Because it... If the restaurant have only one table with, for example, four chair, chair, chairs, and chairs, and your family is more than four, it's a problem. Okay, okay. And what happens? Okay, here's the situation. It is important because if there are people waiting, and some people get ahead, okay? And they go first, but they didn't get first to the restaurant. That is going to be a problem, right? But in the list, let's imagine that I have one table for eight people, one table for four people, and one table for two people. And then I have, again, one table for eight and one table for two. So I have eight, four, two, eight, two. And the first table, that gets available is only for two people, right? So I'm not gonna seat the, the, the eight people in that table, right? So I have to go read the names, who is in a table for two, and they go first, right? That is a procedure, you see? That's why procedures are important. Excellent, thank you very much. Now we're gonna talk about our experiences as well. <clears throat> Let me see, because we're gonna do two activities in one. Okay, these are the activities. It says, okay, here, it's, that's good. You can take a screenshot. Number the steps a waiter follows to take and set up an order. So we're going to order these steps from one to six, okay? In order, the server or the waitress, waiter, does to take an order. And then I'd like you to go online or use a dictionary or whatever you want and look for the meanings to these words. Do you understand the activity we're going to do? Yes. Is it clear for you? Everybody? Yes, What's me. It? Okay. A step by a step. A step by step first. And then when you finish, write the meanings to these words. So let's look for the first step. Just let's do that together. The customer order, confirm the order, see the customer, serve the food, greet the customer, harden the food correctly. Oh, and we talk about this. 
We talk a little bit about this. So what do you think is the first step you, you do? Greet the customer. Greet the customer, correct. That is the first step we do, correct. Good job. So you have step number one. Let's just do two, three, four, five, and six and the meanings for these words. If you can take a screenshot and send it to the group, I will really appreciate that, okay? Okay. Let me see. Okay, let's go. Let's accept and join the breaker rooms, please.
Hello, remember I want meanings, not translation from English to Spanish. No, meanings. <laughs> so look for the meaning, the meaning in English, write it in the meaning bar, and then you send the picture, but no translations, meanings. Sí, así es. Oh. Sé que la misma estaba con nosotros. No, ahorita está la misma con nosotros. Al principio pensé, no, ahorita, ahorita está con nosotros. Ya. Yeah. Ah, ok. Confirmar. Remember that I want the meaning in English, not in Spanish. Tell me some sorry. Notify a el notificar es para notificar orden a todo. Of client, okay. Confirm, confirm is uh, confirm the order, okay. Confirm is um... take uh. Take uh, all the food. Hi, you can remember that you can use Google for this. Okay. You can look for the meanings. Yes, yes. Okay. No, right now he's only <laughs> put the uh, what our mean. Repeat of the order.
Okay. Let's see. Creo que nos confundimos un poquito. We got a little bit of conf we got confused, right? A little bit. Because you were looking for the translation in Spanish and I didn't want the translations in Spanish, right? It's it here. Use your dictionaries and look for the meaning of the words below, right? Meaning, no translation, meaning, right? Okay, let's see. I'm gonna ask Eric Reyes. Can you tell me the steps? <laughs> the steps? Yeah. The number example two. Yeah, number one was greet the customer, right? Yes. The number second two. is sit the customer. Mm -hmm. The third is take customer order. Mm -hmm. uh, the fourth is confirm the order. Mm -hmm. Five serve Fifth. the food. Fifth. And the last. Sixth. Uh, six handle the food correctly excellent good job thank you very much okay let's see <clears throat> jenny's what is the meaning of handle jenny's introduce you? introduce is the order of client introduce the order of the client okay Okay, someone else has a different meaning for handle? Yes. Yes. What do you have, Julio? Uh, deal with something or... Deal. deal with something, okay. Okay. Or people. Or people. Julio, what do you have? To manage a situation or problem. To manage something, right. To manage something, to deal with situation or problem. So to manage, handle, handle my food. It could be to manage or get the food, right. Confirm. Let's see. Veronica Burgos, what is confirm? Mm -hmm. Hello, teacher. Hello, miss. Miss, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Confir is a repeat of the order. O yeah. or o if no. you stay sure of okay. your order. To make sure. To make to sure. make sure to make sure of the order. Yeah, that's a confirmation. Excellent. What is a payment? Uh, let me see. Rafael Antonio Hernandez. What is a payment? of painting is is a uh, use cash of credit card for purchase to purchase okay thank you Jose Alfredo what is a greeting Jose Alfredo what is a greeting <laughs> Nope. Oseas, what is a greeting? Greeting, uh, I forgot it. It's uh, to receive the clients with uh, polite words. Okay. To welcome the clients? Welcome. Yeah. Give a welcome okay. to the clients. Welcome the clients. Okay. What is a notify, Ramiro? Uh, say the client uh, the bill. Notify the bill? Notify the bill of the client. Okay. Okay. Let's take with those meanings for now. Now, let me go with the last attendance. I would just like to go with the confirmation. Eric Giovanni Jimenez Canizales is here. No? Eric Jose Reyes Molina? Present, miss. Okay. Eric Adonai Torres? Oh, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. Me equivoqué toda. Henry Adonai Torres Gomez. Henry is here, no? Jacobo de Jesus, no? Jonathan Jose Oliva? <clears throat> Jose Alfredo Hueso Lopez? No? 
Mayra Patricia Artiga. Yes, here, Miss. Okay. Rafael Antonio Hernández. Present, Miss. Rafael Antonio Martínez Navarrete. Present, Miss. Amado Javier Urrutia Rivera. Present, Miss. Jacqueline Lizette García Miranda. Present, Miss. Okay. Alguien me está diciendo qué pasó en el grupo de WhatsApp. Si dicen que yo no estuve en clases, vayan a defender. Yo aquí, yo aquí ando, aquí ando. ¿Qué le pasó a Miss? Dice aquí. I don't know. I don't know qué le pasó a la clase. Ok, aquí estamos en la clase. Ok. Bye bye. Have a good night. And I will see you again on Monday. Disfruten. Enjoy. Have a good night. Bye. Have a good night. See you on Monday. Bye. Take care. Bye. Bye.